Guys, what up? Welcome to another episode of Cars and Coffee. Yesterday, we brought this brand new McLaren 720 for over $300,000. So what? That was yesterday. Today, on this episode of Cars and Coffee, we're about to go check out another McLaren, Artura. Let's go. Our new small fucking Artura, all right there. Gage in the park is fucking car right there. Oh, this ain't even over there. This is McLaren. How you doing, man? Good about it. Good nice What's your yeah. name, Andy? Andy, yeah. Andy. I'm the regional manager for McLaren on the West. So. Oh, yeah? Regional, like, all the West Coast? All the West Coast stores, yeah. Yeah, yeah we know uh, Zach from McGarrett. Yes, he's not here today, I'm unfortunately. Cars from him. He's, he's a nice guy. He's a great guy. My buddy here just put down a deposit for this guy. Oh, excellent. So you come to have a little spin, see what he thinks. Yeah, yeah. They said it was supposed to be uh, like 30 days, I guess, to be pushed out to like 90 days, but he's he's uh, he's willing to wait. We just, we just picked up a McLaren 720. Nice. What do you call it, 720S? 720S. Yeah, yeah. yesterday. We were at O'Gara yesterday. Could you drive this? Like, is it practical to drive this for a daily? I, I guess it depends what you need to take with you on your daily. So if you're a professional golfer, probably not such a good car. Right. This guy's um, going from downtown to the office, which is 10 miles with a backpack. So for example, yeah, for that, the backpack can go on the passenger seat, it can yeah. go on the rear shelf, we can go in the front here. Um, 10 miles, this will this will run to, it's 19 mile range on this, pure electric. Okay. And then of course you can run the internal combustion engine at any time you feel as well. Yeah. So if you want to slip out in the middle of the night silently, you can do That's so. Funny. Or if you dislike your neighbors, then yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can go in, in yeah. full track track and make some noise. Um, so yeah, as a daily, you don't even need to fire up the internal combustion engine if you choose Damn. not to. Sneak out the window, man. My wife will never find me. <laughs> I'm out, bro. I'm, I'm gonna put a pillow in a, in a sheet just in case she comes looking for me. So Johnny, this is it, bro. Johnny, that's the that's the one you're looking at. That's the one, bro. That's the one. Wait, I'm your driver or co-driver. No, no, no. Yeah. This oh. is John. Sorry. John, I'm sorry, John. I'm This is clean. I'm just a hand. Uh -huh. <laughs> this is clean. Please gonna take you out today. Just talk you through everything. Show you how it all works. Okay. I'll leave you and Cleet. Have some fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So Thanks, food. guys. Thanks. Okay. All right, let's get you in there. Yo, let's, let me you put this. The 18? Hey, this is how you do it. You do butt first. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you. I want to know. I drive a Lamborghini. <laughs> here's the seat adjustment right down here. Okay. And here's the wheel here. Okay. It's typical McLaren stuff. So we like your shoulder blades in the seat and your watch band to be able to reach the top center of the steering wheel. Oh, I never knew. So do it again. Uh, just the watch band like that. So see how you're out of the seat a little bit? Yeah. Let's get this torch a little bit more. Okay, so the idea is we're nine and three on the wheel. We want to have that the strength and stability plus the range of motion. If we're too far away from the wheel, we can't get all the way around on the wheel. And then it pulls you out of the seat. The car then is taking you for a ride instead of you driving. This is the suspension management over here. It's a rocker. See how it rocks? Yeah. This is more, uh, see, it's going up there. Track mode all the way back down to comfort. Over here, electric all the way to track. Same thing, it rocks. Okay. So right now it's an electric. 
Right now it's it needs to be started. So I'm gonna jump in on the other side, we're gonna get it going. We're uh, fire up the air conditioning. Okay, John, do your deal, bro. I'll see you in uh, five minutes, 10 minutes. Uh oh. Now, get it in here. It's a McLaren, so you can do it here or push the button. See all these, so we pulled up in the GTR. Look at all these cars. You got the shot? Yeah, I got it. Huh. Apparently, my two hundred thousand dollars Nissan wasn't as good enough as those cars, even though it costs more than those other cars. Do you guys have security? This guy keeps following me. It's kind of weird. Idea there. Take forever to get through that. Can I help you? <laughs> Did you want to start a tab? Yeah, just in case. No, no, I'm lying. John should be back any minute. I don't want to miss that. Yeah. There you go, brother. Keep it open. No, that's it. Should I wait outside? Dude, I'm a small. I'm a small this. Now you know why I love Atlanta. Remember when we were at the Hyatt in Atlanta? Oh yeah. That was a little bit more my scene. <laughs> I was like, make it rain, <laughs> This is like I love San Diego, bro. But like, out of all the cars that we've seen right now. All of them? Including the Artura and the GT. Which yeah. one would you take? All those cars right there. And the McLarens. Which one would you take? Honestly, dude, I'm going to sound like a jerk. But my STO is better than all these cars here. <laughs> it is not even close. My my, my, my STO is more valuable than that uh, Ventador. Uh, I'm looking. But if you had to pick one. The yellow Ventador. The yellow one? Yeah, I would. I would, yeah. I don't know. It, is it better than the C8? Yes. He has a C8. This is way better. Uh, okay. It's it's. Obviously, like the cold, you know, the, like the, the fucking roar when you turn it on, it's not there. Yeah. But when you like, it's loud when I drive it. Like in my perspective, like I can, like when I when I drive when I floor the C8, it's not that like it's not as sexy as a little bit more exotic sound to it. Yeah, exactly. 8200 RPMs. What's the red line on a C8? was so lit bro i need i'm rethinking everything i'm ready i need to put down my deposit i'm good let's go i'm ready bro come on no i'm just joking i'm just joking i'm just joking he, he, no i didn't drive it i didn't drive it i don't i don't drink and drive hey, hey two things two things i gotta tell you one thing is funny as hell 
So there's like, obviously we're at the, the, the Hilton? Or, no, the Hyatt. 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 Okay, so there's, we're at the Hyatt. And, uh, you know, there's like some guests here. And they, there's a GT3. And there's like an old ass Aventador. And there's a Lamborghini Evo. And uh, there's an R8. R8. Yeah. And they're like right in the front. These son of a bitches took my fucking knee and just parked that shit in the garage. <laughs> Those motherfuckers. Did they really? <laughs> yes, bro. <laughs> they're, they're not up on game, bro. They don't know. They don't know. So like they like like they didn't put it on the nice. Yeah, they didn't, they didn't keep it on the front. They didn't keep it on the front, bro. Okay, so he John's asking me just just because he's doubting. He's not doubting. He's asking questions. He's like, "Yo, um, is that good?" I was like, "Bro, that's the perfect fucking car for you. It's it's the perfect fucking car for you. What you're looking to do with it? Who you are?" And he's like, "Well, what about you?" I was like, "Bro, no. For me, I need the loudest, most obnoxious fucking." annoying shit that it, what's good for me is not necessarily good for him that's in my opinion the perfect car for him I think it is too so. yeah okay I, I, I only have one one consideration it was the the cold start was like I, I he needs he wants exhaust like yeah could we, could we work with that could we get could we could we could we add some pipes I don't know yet probably that's a brand new car, yeah. bro. It's a brand new yeah. car. There's nothing that exists yet. Oh damn, that's oh. Oh what? what? There's not even like aftermarket shit. Look, it's like a eat, brand new car. Yeah. You get it? Look, if you had the car right now, the and like it was there, we we got the like I'm I'm taking it, you know. Like I'm not I'm not second guessing if I should get it. You would take it right now. I take it right now. I give you the deposit, and I drive home. And I, I fuck with it. It's sick. It's. Okay, Zach. If I had that or a 570, like, I'm hell going, no. I'm going that. No, bro. No, hell no. Yeah. You're trying to be like Oscar. Okay, last thing I gotta tell you. Okay, last thing I gotta ask you. Have you met uh, Andy, the regional? Andy? Yes, yes, I know Andy really well. Okay, he's a nice guy. Yeah, he's funny. I was just talking about the phone like 30 minutes ago. Okay, he's funny, so he said, he, yeah. like, we were talking about specs it's, and uh, Sweaty G. He's filming them, and he's like, it's X amount of horsepower, and then fucking five minutes goes by, he's like, hold on, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Are you calculating if it's uh, 700 or something horses, or six, 760 horses, and could, here, take my card so I can just make sure I didn't say the wrong thing. Because if the wrong fucking person says that, you know, like he's like the general manager saying spe- specs, and it's not right. It's, it, it's not gonna be good. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. It's, but, but that's that's the McLaren brand, bro. These guys are playing. They're gonna be on point. These guys are, uh, okay. Okay, we'll let you go, man, in a second. Um, well, I'm happy you enjoyed John. I'm gonna get back to John. Yeah, has, has he made the phone call yet, or is he still avoiding it? He hasn't made a phone call. Hello, confront. It's okay, man. I know I'm in. I know I'm locked in. So, uh, cool, man. If you need anything else, let me know, and then uh, I'll keep you updated on the C8 cycle but most likely being sold this week or early next week so all right bro do your thing man thanks later yeah Yay, all the cars are gone all right guys so we did the test drive we drove the artura we liked the artura i love it i love it what's the price tag quarter mil quarter mil hundred fifty five thousand dollars fifty thousand dollars for a car down payment done We're locking it in. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for hanging out.